Warm welcome to all of you. This is AKS Nani from Smart VRC Bhopal, and today's topic is how to become a smart investor. This is really going to help all of us in becoming more and more smarter. And uh, would love to have your feedback. And also, I invite all of you to provide not only the feedback but also the suggestions regarding the new topics or regarding the presentation also or regarding anything. Regarding question answer session, regarding the length of the uh, video and all those things. Well, <clears throat> here we go. What we are going to cover in this webinar is a Pareto principle, stock picking, smart recap, and questions and answer session. So, uh, beginning to start with a Pareto principle, we all know what is Pareto principle. And there is the 80-20 rule also, uh, known by 80-20 rule also. And it will become more clear when I relate it with the stock investments. You all will agree that 80% of the profits are contributed by 20% of the stocks. Am I not right? Yes, almost not. This is not a 100% exact uh, percentage. This is uh, roughly that majority of the profits are generated by few stocks. So in Pareto principle form, we say 80% of the profits are contributed by nearly 20% of the stocks. Only 20% of intelligence delivered 80% of the returns. Yeah, we make lots of efforts, lots of study. Uh, we, we are present in social media, we are watching television, we are reading so many papers, but you will find that there is hardly even less than 20% of what you read is useful. And that goes into generating good returns or generating good portfolio or picking a good stock. 20% investors create wealth and 80% lose wealth. In fact, the ratio is more stringent. It is not even 20%, it is less than 20%. So be very careful and don't take it easy. Maybe uh, the past one and a half year shows that making money from stocks is very easy, but the fact is not that easy. Here, I would like to give you one, uh, you know, one uh, real conversation uh, with uh, a client. And a uh, couple of days back, he called me and he said that uh, your performance is getting below your peers' performance. What I mean to say is your performance is now not as good as your peers. Now, why this has happened? I asked him how you came to this conclusion. Then he said that your stocks are not rising as fast as they used to be. See, in the short term, it is the market which dictates the share prices. But in medium to long term, it is the sheer financial performance of the company which dictates the share price. So, and moreover, our advice is always for medium to long term. So we are not bothered what is happening in the short term, right? Only 20% of the book on stock investments I read was useful. Rest 80% was waste of time. Yes, this happens not only with uh, this in reference to the stock market book, but also with reference to the other books apart from the academics. Of course, uh, so uh, as you grow older and older, wiser and wiser, you will find that you find less and less material to be useful to you. Maybe at times it will be only 5% useful to you. 80% of successful investors fail to outperform stock indices. Yes, those who are successful, those who are 20% who create wealth are not even able, 80% of these investors are not even able to outperform the stock indices. Really, it is very, very difficult. Even mutual funds, 70%, about 70% of the active mutual funds in India are unable to outperform their underlying benchmark indices. Yes. So if you want to be under top 5% whether I should say, then you will be called as a smart investor. 
So what we need to be to become a smart investor. So this is the 2080 principle. 20% 20 of the efforts should lead to 80% of the result. So this poll we are skipping. Uh, I will explain you how to become a smart investor with reference to the stocks advised in our various services. And you will appreciate that how simple was the logic and how in such a short time I can explain for each and every stock that why we included in such and such services. To start with, on 18th of March 2020, try to focus the date. On 23rd of March 2020, that was the bottom when Sensex made 25,981 points. So just five days before that, how daring we were that we recommended Cosmo Films at the price of rupees 242. What was the logic? You will recall that even on 18th of March, we knew that any time there can be a lockdown. And in fact, in Europe and China already, it was at a very high level. This COVID was spreading it very, very fast. Even in India, it was spreading pretty fast. But the absolute number of COVID patients were pretty low at that time. But we knew that what is going to come what is going to come is we are going to remain at homes and we will consume more ready-made food, more ready-made food and more uh, of the items being called from online retailers means more demand for packaging and more demand for packaging means the packaging industry. And from the packaging, we selected Cosmo Films at 242 and today it is 1500. Of course, target was pretty low because in smart gains, we uh, our holding period varies from three months to 24 months. So target was naturally very low. But what here I want to highlight is if you pick the right stock with simple logics, you can get mega returns. So at the current price, it is 6.2x. So your money has multiplied more than six times in a matter of just one and a half years. Now just imagine how much time it takes your money to double in a bank. Even without considering inflation and tax, it takes 14 years to double your money in bank. And here it is six times, more than six times in a matter of only one and a half year. So, and very simple thinking, packaging will be required. And also there is one more factor. There is the raw material. Raw material is dependent on crude and crude was declining like anything. In fact, you will recall that crude went negative also, of course, for only a few days. So this was a win-win situation for packaging films. And you all know what is what has happened not only to Cosmo films, but also to other packaging films like um, Poly, Polyplex, Uflex also. And all these uh, Jinder Poly also is doing well. So simple logic. Next was again on 18.3. Now you will be surprised that on 18.3, why we recommended two stocks. In fact, we recommended seven stocks. Normally, we recommend only one stock every Wednesday. But this was the day when we recommended seven stocks. Not that we knew that there is going to be a bottom on 23rd of March. But we knew that stocks are some of the stocks were available at dirt cheap valuations. So that was the reason. Second was the Infosys at 573. Today it is 1763, 3.1x. What was the logic? Come what may, in IT companies will be least affected, even with the lockdown. We all knew that. Of course, we did knew that technology will take such a big leap due to the COVID, but we all knew that IT companies would be least affected. So that was the simple reason and Infosys being the leader, we recommended this stock. Then was Relaxo. This is on 6th of May, 2020. So the bottom was over and at 605 we recommended, today it is 1162. 
1.9x, almost doubled. What was the reason for uh, recommending Relaxo? Because we have not recommended Relaxo for many, many years. Then why we recommended Relaxo? Very simple. The product of Relaxo is footwear and mainly uh, uh, medium range footwear. And it has got very good brand ambassadors for each range. And maybe people are staying in their homes. They are not going out during the COVID time. But still, they will wear the slippers. They will wear the footwear. This was a very simple reason. And also, again, the raw material prices, raw material prices were very low because raw material prices were dependent on crude. That was a simple logic. So with that simple logic, we got two X returns. Osh, this was a chemical sector. And by 30th of June, it was very clear that there is going to be a China plus one policy. Yes, people were, people means uh, the big companies around the globe, they were looking for alternate to China. Rather, I should say they were talking, not looking for at that time, because the uh, period was of heavy, of uh, the period was of very critical crisis time, and people were talking of alternate source rather than uh, apart from China. So, Poshak was one of those chemical companies which are available at very attractive valuations from the chemical sector. And chemical sector was especially already doing well. So we selected Poshak and the result is 4.5x returns. Very good returns in a matter of only 15 months. Then came Tata Alexi. We committed at 1, 2, 3, 4. Yes, the numbers are very interesting, 1, 2, 3, 4. And the returns are also very interesting, 4.8x in one year. Tata Alexi, 4.8 time returns in one year. <clears throat> and what was the logic of picking Tata Alexi? The results, a very strong positive commentary by the Tata management. I have never heard such a strong and positive and confidence building commentary from Tata's. So that was the only reason. Then came the mind tree. That was uh, advised when the price was 1750 and today it is 4600. Returns are 2.6x and this return is in a matter of only little over six months. Yes, in six months, that is on 3rd of March 2021 when the index was had already crossed 50,000. At that time we recommended, today index is 60,000 and uh, small plus. So index is up by 20% and this stock is up by 2.6x. What was the reason for putting Mindtree? Because we saw that in the mid cap segment, the niche companies were doing very well and Mindtree was available at comparatively at attractive valuations also compared to itself, its own performance. So that was the reason for recommending Mindtree and we got fabulous returns. Then came the Shivalik Biometal. Very few of you may be knowing the name of this company and this was recommended on 31st of January. This has to do with bimetallic contacts, which uses copper and it is. it was recommended on 31st of March, considering that its raw material prices were very low during the previous quarter. So, in view of the expecting very good results from this company, we recommended this stock and we got 3.3x again in little less than nine months, uh, six months. Within six months, we got 3.3x. Also, it was a, uh, fortunately, this company decided to get listed on NSC also. And then the volumes increased, not only the volumes, but the interest of the investors also increased. And then the rest is history. So you can see uh, how beautiful returns have been earned. And this is one of the reasons that how smart billionaire picks has made almost a vertical kind of path. If you compare with BSE Sensex, you can see 
how beautifully we have outperformed it. Even if you compare with the past performance, this performance is one of the best performance so far. <clears throat> On 23rd March 2020, that is the day when the BSC Sensex was at 25,981. At that day, on that day, Smart Billionaire Picks was 42 lakhs, and today it is 137 lakhs. That gives you gains of 226% compared to 131% by BSC Sensex. This is smartness. This is smartness. Check your portfolio. I, I know because I keep on getting so many calls from the new subscribers or I, whether I can say the uh, prospective customers. And when I ask them how much returns they have made during last one and a half year, and the result is, oh, sir, we made very good returns. I said, how much? My money has grown by 60%. Somebody said that it has grown by 50%, 80%. But all this shows underperformance. Yes, because Sensex itself is up by 131%. Anything below 131% is underperformance. And here we have performed, outperformed with 226%. That is almost 80 to 85% better than BSE Sensex. And this comes through smartness. BSC Sensex stocks, that is the index stocks constituents cannot be changed so frequently, but we can change your portfolio stocks. Now there's another service, Smart Multibagger. Here only the Multibagger stocks are advised. And here the performance is equally encouraging. On 19th of March, again, just five days before when the market formed the bottom, we recommended Mothers and Sumi at rupees 60. Current price is 225, change is 3.8x. What was the logic of recommending Mothers and Sumi at that time when there was going to be a lockdown? When we knew that we shall not be able to take out our vehicles, when we knew that people will not be able to purchase their vehicles offline, at that time we recommended Mothers and Sumi. Logic was very simple. It was pretty highly debted, and company was undergoing through a huge restructuring process. And this was one of the one of the I can say, at least in my opinion, it is one of the best auto parts company in the world. Moreover, it is spread throughout the global countries, throughout the markets, global markets. It is spread so. The thinking was that since this company has done exceedingly well from last 15 to 20 years, there is no reason management will not take the appropriate steps to restructure it, to bring it back to the profits, huge profits, whether I should say, and exactly that has been done. And there is the result. We got smart gains of 3.8x. Second was Caprihans. This was recommended only only two days after the bottom formation. Of course, we were not aware that this is the bottom, but we recommended Caprihans at rupees 27. It's raw material. It, it manufactures plastic sheets and good quality plastic sheets. And uh, the raw material is again very much dependent on uh, crude prices. And that is how we recommended this stock. And the results are there 4.8x. 4.8 times returns in a matter of one and a half years. Then came the KI Industries. That was on 20, 22nd of March, 2020. That is the last year. And returns are 3.6x. We recommended at 271. Current price, 979. That gives you 3.6 times returns. KI Industries results. Why, why, why we recommended this? There were a couple of reasons. Because just before this period, company came out with a, a preferential allotment and shares were offered at a price of about 500 rupees a piece and stock was available at 271. Again, this company was debted, of course, not very highly debted. And also its raw material were plastic 
there is the uh, insulation of the wires aluminum copper all were ruling at very very low prices so that was the reason and we were right we were proved right we got 3.6x returns indian voters on 25th of june 2020 so in a matter of 15 months we are sitting at 2.2x so what was the reason of recommending indian hotels when the whole country was under lockdown very simple look ahead how much time it will take to normalize the operations okay so before covid that is in january february this stock was available at rupees 140 and now it is 82 rupees tata group company one of the best companies, not even in India, but ever, even at global level. Lots of good quality management, good quality hotels, it operates. And also now, it is managing also many, many hotel chains. So uh, that was the logic. And we thought that, okay, it may take about, maybe about three years, four years. So this was recommended in Multibagger with three to four years consideration in mind. And we thought that it will double, it should double at least in three to four years, but it doubled in just 15 months. Not only doubled, more than doubled in 15 months. Then comes the happiest minds. That was on 17th of September, 2020. We recommended at 387. Today, the price is 1433. Of course, we have exited from this uh, around, I think, around 1100 or 1200 because our target was like that. And <clears throat> this has given 3.7x. Reason, very simple. This company, majority of the turnover comes from high technology products. That was the only reason. And on, during this time, that is the September, October time, it was very clear that technology is taking a lead at global level. So that was the reason. Of course, of course, there was a reason regarding a person behind this happiest mind, the same person, Mr. Ashok Suta, who started Mindry. Then on 23rd of October, we recommended a stock, which was, uh, I cannot say uh, how much returns it has given and how many times we have recommended this stock in smart gains and only once in smart multivagor. And uh, uh, the recorded price was 129 rupees. Today it is 806. That gives one of the best returns among all the stocks recommended in our advice. That is 6.2x in only 11 months. In 11 months, your money, money has multiplied by more than six times, only 11 months. And the reason, what was the reason? This company, I'm tracking from last so many years, and I knew this company is gradually increasing its capacity. Of course, valuations were not that attractive, but what was attractive was the future. The company decided to expand its operation. The company gave a very positive commentary. The company tied up with, of course, in a period of time, not uh, during exactly at this time. Over a period of time, company made so many decisions to increase the capacity and also it tied up with IKEA and this was not um, imaginable uh, I should say that during the COVID time, during the COVID time when the lockdown was there, especially in US, people decided to renovate their houses, especially the kitchen because a lot of works for, because kitchen was being used uh, very whether I should say with high uh, efficiency, means more and more people were uh, using kitchen instead of, because they were not going out, so they were using kitchen and they want a good kitchen uh, items, including the their kitchen sink, including the exhaust and all those things. And here was the company Acrisil, which was a leader in this special type of uh, manufacturing kitchen sinks and this company got this is actually one of the four companies in the world to have that technology and being a smaller player among the four 
this company got the advantage and over a period of time its story kept on getting better and better and better and that is how we got 6.2x returns in a matter of 11 months bajaj finance uh, i don't think we have ever recommended this stock to sell from last 10 years we have recommended only when to sell only when we have achieved the target or in the target oriented products but in case of baskets we have never exited from this stock we have exited only because of the increasing weightage but not because of the deteriorating performance so we recommended this stock on 28th of october when it was very clear that yes vaccine is there and then we recommended this stock with the consideration that maybe in two years or three years normalcy will return and this company will be back on track also we came uh, we understood we came uh, we came to know that this company is undergoing highly technological transformance so that was the reason and we got investors about 2.3x returns in a matter of 11 months and then tata alexi the star performer a star performer in a sense uh, this was the biggest company among all these companies biggest in a sense uh, in terms of the sector position and this was recommended on 13th of january 2021 yes only about eight and a half months ago and uh, recommended at 2300 rupees today it is 5864 that gives 2.5x what was the reason reason was very simple very positive commentary from Tata Alexi, as we discussed in case of smart games also about this stock. Then come the smart freedom. Here we pick only the selected stocks and uh, most of the stocks were from smart games and smart multibagger, but at different periods of time, because here the focus was more on building a steady wealth rather than fast wealth, but now we are making it a bit more enterprising and started with 10 lakhs is already 26.87 lakhs and we hope to multiply it about three or four times in the next four to five years then comes the smart sip smart sip has done wonderfully well of course uh, we cannot compare it from uh, because it is a sip means you are investing a Every fifth of the month, we are recommending one stock and you are investing a fixed sum. So <clears throat> since the start, that is on 5th of October 2016 to 26th September 2021, we have invested 6 lakh rupees, 10,000 rupees. Every month, this, we are uh, making calculation based on the assumption that you are investing 10,000, you can invest any sum. So with that, it has grown to 11.21 lakhs, almost double. And that is exceptionally good performance, considering that one should not, one should try to appreciate that. It is not that the money has doubled from 2016 to 2021 in five years, but money has been invested in a staggered way. Now, this is a wonderful uh, uh, message for all of us. To become more smarter, it goes like this, being prepared on a few occasions in a lifetime to act promptly in scale in doing some simple and logical thing will often dramatically improve the financial results of that lifetime. This is exactly what has happened during the COVID, but this statement has been made much before the COVID period, and I will show you who has made this statement. Yes, we were all prepared. We means smart ERC team. We were all prepared. Let any occasion come and we are there to take the fullest advantage of that occasion. And this happened truly in case of COVID. Performance speaks. Few major opportunities will usually come to one who continuously searches and waits with a curious mind that loves diagnosis involving multiple variables. Yes, we were open to all sorts of variables, all sorts of outcomes. As I, as I told you, 
At times, we invested because of the low raw material prices. At times, we invested with three years or four years in mind. At times, we invested considering that the IT, especially the IT sector, will be the major beneficiary. Uh, major beneficiary in a sense, the major sector which will whose performance will not be highly impacted because of the COVID. And there are many many other things which we discussed. This statement is given by Mr. Charlie Mogar. He is a partner. With Mr. Warren Buffet in Berkshire Hathaway. Now this is a quote by Peter Lynch. We all know Peter Lynch. He is one of the best. He is known to be one of the best fund managers uh, till date in terms of the returns for returns of about twenty six percent for thirteen long years. There is no shame in losing money on a stock. Everybody does it. What is shameful to is is to hold on to a stock, or worse, to buy more of it when the fundamentals are deteriorating. Of course, this is a very different uh, quote, but very useful uh, in making you a smart. In a sense, I will give you an example. When the first time RBI made public statement that Yes Bank. Reported NPS were under uh, underrated. So NPS reported by Yes Bank were way less than what RBI thought, or what were the regulations as per those regulations? NPS were less. In actuality, the NPS were more. So they have underreported. The NPS. That was the first time when we exited Yes Bank. In two of our products, we were holding Yes Bank, and when we exited at that time, the price was two hundred eighty-three rupees. Yes, and then it it happened to be like a cockroach theory. So it was not a single cockroach. There were ten more, and slowly and slowly, lot more other revelations were made and. We all know what happened to the uh, bank share price. It came down, and today it is about thirteen rupees. So, and that stock was recommended, I think, uh, at rupees three hundred ten, and we exited at two hundred eighty three. Yes, we made a small loss, and investors were at that time. I received phone calls also that uh, you have recommended this stock only few days ago. Why we are exiting this stock, and that too at a loss. So that part, that is what I told them. That look for the future. Don't look at what price you have purchased. And what most of the retail investors did was they kept on averaging yes back. I know. On the simple pretext that it has gone to two eighty rupees, it is available at rupees one fifty. We should add more. It fell to hundred. They added more. It fell to fifty. They added more. Now what has happened? Uh, again, a quote by Charlie Munger. He says that <clears throat> you will do better if you have passion for something in which you have aptitude. If Warren had gone into ballet, yes, where uh, there is a ballet dance, no one would have heard of him. Correct it. So, if you have a passion for equity research, if you have a passion for learning how the business works and how to build a confidence between. How to build a trust between the corporate performance and the share price? Then only you should go into all these things. Otherwise, you should either invest in a mutual fund or hire an advisor. Our ideas are so simple that people keep asking us for mysteries when all we have are the most elementary ideas. That is what I say. The smart investor is the one who makes it simple, not complex. You will find there are many, many advisors who present their analysis in a very complex form. Why? At the heart of the heart, they also know that making money from stocks is not that complex. But we make it complex, and we means when advisors makes it complex, and that is loved by the investors. That is a wonderful quote by Mr. Peter Lynch. If you are prepared to invest in a company, 
then you ought to be able to explain why in simple language that a fifth grader could understand and quickly enough so the fifth grader won't get bored. You should be able to explain why you have purchased this in a simple way. As I have tried my best to give you a simple explanation why we purchased so many stocks, I have given you an example. So simple. I never talked about the word like return on capital and right, return on equity in all those things. In fact, I myself never looked for those ratios because looking at the numbers for the last four years, five years, you can make out what is the kind of management it is. Smart word, keep it simple. Whatever you do, keep it simple. Whether you study, whether you watch television, whether you read the messages in the social media, whether you want to hold the stocks, make it simple. If you are feeling uncomfortable, then exit. It is as simple as that. The principle is keep it simple so that you sleep as sound, you have a sound sleep. That is very much important. So what uh, we have covered in this presentation is like this. Look for a smart spark. Yes, there is a spark. You need a spark. Otherwise, every information is available to all the investors. You can go to the any scanning, uh, any website which scans the financial parameters and you can find the stocks, but that is not the right way. Right way in a sense, that is available to all. And the thing which is available to all, you cannot be a winner from that lot. You need to be different. You need to be way ahead of them. So you first, you need a spark. Very recently, one very big company, management, that CEO made a statement for the first time ever. And that was a very different kind of statement, which I never expected from that company. I'm talking in a positive sense. And after that, that company has made small, small, unexpected acquisitions in the technology field. Soon we are going to come out, come out with a, a report on that stock. And also we will have a live webinar. That would be a paid webinar. That is very uh, interesting. Remain uh, fully invested always. Yes, as I say, because at least I don't have the capability to print the market. And the SBP and S, uh, uh, Smart Freedom, SIP, we have never asked to make an exit or never created a cash. Numbers speak as we have discussed and always think long, think of long term. There is 100% correlation between the company's financial performance and its share price in the long term, 100%. We can help you a lot uh, in becoming smarter and you can get benefited from our stock advisory from our Smart Insights Pro. These are the small, small set of videos and very insightful. Also, I'm author of the book, We to Billionaire. And also we have the calculators. These are free financial freedom calculators. You can find out how much money you need at the time of retirement. And accordingly, how much you need to save and invest in stocks. And based on how much returns you're expecting. So, uh, that is all I wanted to share with you. If you have liked this webinar, and especially those who are attending this webinar for the first time, and if they liked it, then they can send their name and city at this WhatsApp number. We will include them in our country-wise WhatsApp groups we have made, and we share very useful information. Hardly we share one or two messages in a day, but those are pretty useful. We make you a smart investor. So you can also forward this message to your friends and ask them to send us a request on this WhatsApp number, 9755920780. And don't forget to write your name and city. Yes, many of the stocks which we have covered today, uh, they may be still, in open position in a couple of our products and in many of the stocks we have already exited. So the stocks which we have discussed, investors should not construe them to be an investment advice. 
So here we go with uh, question answer session. First, I will go through the uh, messages you have posted, the queries you can raise in the message box and in the chat box. And then subsequently, you can also raise your hand through the reaction button and I will ask you to unmute and you can ask your query, but restrict your query to only single question at a time. Thank you very much. Uh, I hope you like this session and you can recommend your friends also to be part of this free webinar almost every weekend, maybe Saturday or Sunday. We shall include, we shall inform you about the time in the WhatsApp group. Thank you. Sir, shares which you have recommended and given negative returns. Okay. Uh, about, I think two stocks have uh, broken the stop loss in smart gains and multi bagger. I don't think any stock has given negative returns or even uh, have broken the stop loss. Which industry will do well in next one to two years? <clears throat> we are more focused on the company rather than the industry or the economy because it is ultimately the company which will give you the returns. Uh, it is ultimately the CEO of the company which steers the company. So come what may, whatever may be the economy, whatever may be the uh, sector prospects, if the management is smart enough, then you need not have to worry. <clears throat> I am your smart gain subscriber. If I want to do fresh investment of one lakh in SBP, how should I start? See, smart SBP is today 1.38 crores. So making a replica with rupees one lakh would be very difficult because when we started at that time, the share prices used to be, uh, most of the stock prices were below 100 rupees and today most of the stocks are below 200 rupees. So making a replica is very difficult. I will give you an example. Suppose if you start with SVP today with one lakh, and I ask you to have ask you to have seven percent of three M. It is not possible because the share price is twenty four thousand rupees. Same with Bajaj Finance and many other high prices stocks. So my advice would be to start with at least five lakh rupees. Mr. Prabhat, we ask, kindly unmute yourself. Good morning, sir. Good morning, good morning, sir. Sir, uh, I must thank you that the whatever knowledge we have received because of you. So you are our financial guru, no doubt on that. And, thank, uh, you. thank you very much. And I am also your subscriber and uh, we have learned a lot of things from you. Okay. Uh, I also keep on learning a lot of uh, things from you people, but I don't share. But uh, uh, I am also thankful to all of you because uh, everyone keep on learning in this market and that is the way to become more and more smarter. Now, sir, what we, uh, we are asking, like, uh, suppose any uh, company we purchase, uh, any share. Yeah. And in this share, if we see that the price is going down and then we again research it that, the, okay, the share is good and uh, whatever fundamentals we have seen is good. And again, the price is going down. So at which price we have to exit at uh, in all these conditions, like 20% of that, uh, whatever the purchase, or we have to be continue be in the uh, share, uh, it, if it, it goes down around 60 or 70%, whatever we see. Okay. Uh, it is like this. Uh, in absolute terms, it is not advisable to keep a stop loss. Rather, I would say that keep a stop loss with respect to the market, with respect to the Sensex. If the Sensex is falling, like at the time of COVID, and if your stock is falling less than the Sensex, then no need to worry. But if your stock is falling much more than the Sensex, 
under normal circumstances also suppose today is sensex 60000 i will give you an example suppose today the sensex is 60000 and your share price is 100 rupees after 3 months sensex is still 60000 and your share price has steadily gone down to 80 rupees or 75 rupees then it is definitely a cause of concern and you should make an exit many a times not many a times rather sometimes you may not be able to find out the reason why the stock is falling down and maybe the insiders or maybe the people in the know they may be in, uh, selling the stock and that is the reason but this happens very in a very rare case but that should be the uh, that should be the stop loss so in those cases i would recommend that you should keep a stop loss at about 20% or 25% with respect to the index always okay. keep i hope you got my point i got it sir means uh, what is suppose index is going down 10% yeah. and our share is going down 30% then yes. we should go uh, yes, yes 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 20% with respect to sensex yes we yes. have to take this yes, it yes. is like that okay sir yeah. thank you very much sir. thank you thank you Thanks. How can I study the fundamentals of any company if I find technically good on chart as I am trader? Yeah, studying fundamentals uh, is a different field from being a trader. Being studying charts is a totally different thing, and studying fundamentals is way different. As far as studying fundamentals is concerned, uh, the easiest way is to plot a table as we produce in Smart Gains and Multivagger also for last four years or five years sales depreciation, interest of go, tax, and profit, and dividend. Now, try to correlate whether it is a uh, increasing dividends with respect to sales or declining uh, interest costs with respect to sales, how the depreciation is moving. If depreciation is rising steadily, that means company is continuously expanding like that. that. That is the best way. And of course, ultimately, you have to see what is the P and what is the growth rate and that that is how you learn. The best way to learn is first study, then apply that study in small uh, amount of your portfolio and keep on this cycle running. It cannot happen that you study at in one go and start investing. That is not advisable because what you study and what you see practically are different in many ways. Uh, I, have, I would like to share one small story. Long, long back, maybe about hmm, about 25 years back, it happened that I attended one uh, very rigorous course on equity. And on the first day evening during the tea time, I asked the I asked the lecturer that uh, uh, from how long he is investing into the stocks, and I was surprised by his reply when he said that he has never invested. Why am I asked this question? I asked this question because the way things were being taught in a very highly theoretical way and practically what I have seen at that time in the market were very different. So you have to find a combination. You have to find, you have to use the combination. What is practical and what is theoretical has been given. And then you will find that not much fundamental knowledge is required. Only you must be able to understand how the business runs. That is required. That is very much required. And uh, you can read a lot of books. You can read books written by Peter Lynch, especially uh, from, I'm very much impressed by Peter Lynch. He has written really very good books and practical books and uh, least fundamentals. Least fundamentals in a sense, the least uh, ratios or technical terminology he has used. Fundamental course. Yes, uh, I would like to join any fundamental course from you. Yeah, we have our own uh, videos. I have prepared the videos of about 20 minutes each. And there are uh, there is a, in Smart Insights Pro, there is a course with the name of title Equity Research. You can, you can subscribe to that and you can watch the videos we have. After every video, there is a there is a small question answers, uh, uh, multiple choice question answer sheet also. And you can 
measure your performance there and it is very very low priced mr shanmuga kindly unmute yourself good morning asanani ji good morning sir good morning sir how are you great great sir great <laughs> sir i want to clarify yeah. for lomsum which of the product uh, of uh, hello applicable and for sip mode which is applicable which product is applicable by smart vrc provided by smart vrc okay. and in i want to clarify whether the product uh, given in the smart billionaire pings will be replicated in smart gains or smart sip something like that could you please throw some highlights and okay. which will be the product which will be ideally suited for lumsum and for sip okay. thank you sir okay thanks so it is like this uh fulfilling the needs of all kinds of investors we have four products so if you are if you want to invest every week there is also a systematic investment plan then you can go for smart gains because every week we come in one stock if you want to invest monthly then you can go for smart invest uh, smart sip where on every fifth of the month we recommend one stock and also you can opt for smart multi bagger because in smart multi bagger we recommend one stock every 25 days so for systematic investment plan there are several products if you want to invest lump sum then you can invest in sbp that is smart billionaire picks and sbp is a part of smart gains only you need not have to subscribe separately for sbp sbp is a part of smart gains so for lump sum you can you have an option of investing in sbp you have an option of investing in smart freedom also smart freedom is today worth about 27 lakhs little less than 27 lakhs and sbp 1.38 lakhs you can create your own basket with your investment amount it can be a fraction or multiple of these amounts what i have told you also you can use a mix mix of uh, lump sum and systematic investment like in smart gains we provide you can invest lump sum amount in sbp and systematic every week you can invest through pick of the week in multi bagger you can you can uh, invest lump sum amount in the past four five stocks recommended by us because once you subscribe anybody who subscribe he has an access to all the recommendations given in smart multi bagger for last 3 4 years and similarly for smart gains also so there is all possibilities are there it is up to you uh, which product suits you you can decide yourself thank you ji thank you for your great insights god bless you thank for you. educating the investor community like us thank you sir thank you sir. thank you ji yeah okay mr sk patel uh yes sir good morning good morning sir good morning good morning, good morning. Uh, very good uh, informative uh, talk from your side every week we are really grateful to you thank you sir I, 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 i am grateful to you sir you are sparing uh, i am alone but uh, i see more than 100 people sparing one hour at least one hour every week and no sir we feel that uh, the crowd should go up and up every week because of the uh very good i mean uh, information about investing in the stocks thank you thank you people are so yeah so confident and so open uh, about this uh, topics yeah a uh, mac simple question is sir yes sir if, if the industry is not doing well mm -hmm. and the management is good mm -hmm. but then you know because the industry is not going good company will not do good mm -hmm. so industry we uh, that is my view huh? we yeah. should find out the industry first and if that is doing good and we pick up the right uh, management in that particular industry 
then the return has to be fantastic. Yes, yes. For example, the steel industry, it was not doing well. And suddenly it started doing well. And see Tata Steel or JW Steel when the management is, uh, you know, very good. Yes. So at, at that moment, if we enter in a company with a very good management, I think the return will be much, much higher than otherwise. Yeah. Do you, what is your uh, view on that? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, I partly agree with you. I have got a little uh, different kind of opinion. Even if the industry is not good, but the management is very good. Then also, you can get a multi-bagger kind of stuff. Sir, I and agree with you. Yeah. It will yes, take sir. a very long period of time to... Now, for example, real estate industry, it was not doing for last uh, 8 to 10 years. So, people, we will have to wait for 10 years to see the result. But now, suppose at this juncture, if we invest in a right company with a very good management, Next one year will give a very good return. That is what I feel. Yeah. I mean, oh, that is oh, okay. how I... Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I, will, I, will, I will tell you, sir. Why yeah. I said I partly agree with you. Uh, because uh, there, are, there are sectors where the companies have the option to export their product. Like it happened in textile company. Uh, textile company is a very low entry barrier company. And that is why there is a, uh, the profit margins are very low. But there are companies like Page Industries, which showed that in textile also, they can do wonder. And even uh, they did it in the, <clears throat> in the domestic market itself, without the help of exports, and they did it, they did it exceptionally well. Coming to the steel sector, the whole sector was not doing well from last so many years, I think for last more than 10 years. But there was a company like JSW Steel, which did exceptionally well. If you look at the share price and you will find that JSW did much, much better than even Tata Steel. So there are companies in all sectors which have got upper end because of their management. I agree with you. NPFC agree. also, uh, you will find that Bayaj Finance did wonderfully well when the other NBFCs were not doing that well. Now, in exports, you can see uh, Madhuran and Suri. There are many, many examples which can, if they don't find the local industry of much, the domestic industry of much potential, they go for exports. It happened with Bharat Forge. It's a very old story. And they, they installed a press whose capacity was so big that they can easily serve the whole demand from the India. So what they did was they opted for exports and today almost 40% of their income is from exports. Regarding the real estate, as you said, <laughs> there is no chance of any export. So uh, even in real estate, if you compare the performance of Godrej properties with respect to the other real estate players, you will find that it did reasonably well. Of course, the returns were way lower than the industry, than the uh, Sensex. These are highly cyclical type of uh, sectors, like in real estate. So it is really very difficult. If we wait for the industry to turn around, like this has happened in the steel now, but uh, you will find that whenever the stocks are available at very low P ratios, in case of cyclical industries, that means it is the very near to the peak of the cycle. Thank you very much. Thank you. Sir. Yeah, uh, you, you, you wanted to say something more? No, I just, uh, because I have seen some of the, uh, 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 I agree with you, JSW is the lowest cost manu conversion cost manufacturing company in the world. Yeah. Because Mr. Sergeant Jindal, who is the managing director, yes, yes. is just an uh, exceptional man. Yes. You know, and himself is an uh, engineer. Yeah. So he knows the in and out of that industry. And it took 20 years for JSW to more or less compete with uh, Tata Steel, who is a 120 years old company. Yes. And he says, I will overtake within next five years. And I think yes. he will. Yes, yes. Uh, I agree with you, sir. Yeah, because I've met him, you see. Yes. Yes. And I found him very, very, very clear about his ideas and very, I mean, uh, what you call um, totally, you know, business oriented mind. And that is why this JSW energy. 
yeah. from 100 rupees to 350 within i think one month or something he want to now divert uh, from that old age type of man uh, this one electric energy to a new one yes so you know he's a very dynamic man also yes, yes. from one to another very fast yeah yeah, yeah. So i agree entirely with you who is the uh, jockey you know yes yes, yes. i i 100% agree with you sir i am i am adding on the jockey as well as the horse horse right i agree with you jockey Thank alone you. or horse alone cannot do wonders it is Perfect. the combination both yeah yeah it is the combination That's sir how long uh, you are investing in stocks sir when i was in college i had a tremendous liking and i used to go to the stock uh, that bsa building i couldn't make out what they are doing at that time it was a hand you know it was not computerized yes, yes, so yes, hand yes. they were sewing yes. and all those things yes. so there my was, first investment yeah my first investment was reliance textile i was very much impressed by dhirubhai ambani but at that time the atmosphere so was so bad everybody was telling that he will run away he is <laughs> not good man he is that so i was yes. afraid yeah, and yeah. i applied only for 100 shares i got 100 shares and you will not believe today the total value of reliance is more than 1 crore so you can imagine the great sir, great management similarly yeah. hdfc group you know slow but steady but they give the proper you know mr parekh deepak parekh yes so uh, i entirely agree the industry in which you are like reliance now they are shifting to solar yes. you know government wants that um, oil should you know should not be uh, get reduced as far as mm. import is concerned within next 5 to 10 years mm. so that will, they will do it and they are very fast in decision making and on a layer, large scale you know so that makes lot of returns Yeah. So what is the age now? What is the age? Sir? My age? Oh, sir, I exceeded sixty. Okay. <laughs> so uh, you are investing from uh, more than thirty-five, forty years, right, sir? Agreed. Yes, yes. It was a very small, small investment initially, ten years, because I I was not knowing the stock market. I lost a lot of money also initially. but then you know through experience and uh, guidance from seniors i tried then look at the balance sheet see all those literatures and now i am confident you know sir uh, i would like to take uh, one more minute from you sure sure uh, when you started at that time your friends must have also uh, started investing in stocks how many of those friends are still investing No, no. I think the majority of them uh, no, now they stop investing because of losses. Initial losses they were afraid, mm -hmm. and they were in business, so they shifted to their own business. But I had got a tremendous liking. That liking, you know, pushes you forward. Even mm -hmm. if you lose money, then you have to find out why I lost money. What was the reason? Where I went wrong? Mm -hmm. And then you have to move like that. And of course, you see, this is also a business. you cannot be 100% correct but you have to take all the precautions and then you have to jump yeah that's correct. all so uh, i think um, um, listening to your uh, this thing also being a engineer you have come into this line that's so your interest and the way you are you know explaining everything so is a very seasoned uh, man uh, in this line now sir you are much more experienced than me I agree, but uh, I agree entirely with you. But you are now totally involved into this, you know, yes, yes, with yes. all all the facilities you must have developed also, you know, to find out everything. In yeah. my case, it's not like that to yeah. that extent. Yeah. The intense uh, intensity which you are uh, in which you uh, with which you are there. Mm -hmm. uh, I am investing on my own, and I am recommending to some of the friends also who are very close. Mm -hmm. That is how I go. okay are you using uh, charts also sir no sir i don't like i don't understand charts i am more on fundamentals rather than charts charts i don't know people say it is working in some people say it is not working but um, in my case it is not my cup of tea i try to look into but um, you see charts will vary according to the market forces some operator can uh, do something and chart will go away i mean you know i will tell you once to one so small story if you allow me to yeah sure sure sir i was sitting in a one company 
and somebody came he told that i am representing the leading stock broker mm-hmm. and he was with me for one hour in explaining the charts mm-hmm. then i told now tell me about the company in which we are sitting see, see the chart and tell me next within next one uh, one year uh, one week what will be the price and mm-hmm. he was unable to he i told see this company is operated by the management Okay. they can do anything to the price then your chart will not work mm-hmm. so that is how um, i am not very much confident about these charts it all depends upon uh, maybe i mean some people must be master in that but i am not i see fundamentals i see the past record as you rightly told mm-hmm. management the product they are manufacturing what will be the future next 6 months 1 year 3 years 5 years when mm-hmm. the company will be able to continue Mm-hmm. Uh, all those factors i look into and then i start investing you know deep of nitrate you know it was 300 400 and i was very much convinced when i listened to the uh, uh, con call of deep of deep of nitrate and i invested now which is 2400 or something mm-hmm. so we have to see from various angles and then start and that is the right way sir i appreciate that that is the right way con calls are a great source of information great source correct and you ask questions also so that you will be yeah. able to know yeah. Yeah. their reaction that is so, the that is the best part because when yeah. a investor when a research analyst asks a question you should be able to answer it appropriately correct yeah so that is how it goes you know sir uh, i would like to share with you that we have got yeah. uh, we have got very good response uh, regarding my chat with you in the chat box i am reading you some of the responses uh, good feedback and examples from mr patel oh very good thank Secondly, you secondly mr patel your speech is quite motivating and inspiring third thank you patel ji for sharing no, your experience no. and insights no no thank you very much and uh, there is one more gentleman he he says that kya hum patel sir ko dekh sakte hain kya can you uh, switch on your video वो कैसे होता है मुझे पता नहीं है फ्रेंकली आई विल टेल यू ये आई मीन दिस Yeah, yeah, and anybody can. I will give you. Anybody wants to talk to me regarding stock market, so any advice, etc. I will give you my mobile number also. Okay. Provided Mr. Asrani gives permission, no? That is very sure, sure, sir. Sure, sir. Sure, sir. One more, one more feedback is uh, from Mr. Srinivas Vidhapali, and he is uh, from Hyderabad, and he says, "Super Patel sir, ji." Oh, so thank you. Uh, thank you, we all enjoyed the conversation with you. and about couple of months back uh, we had a conversation uh, with uh, the gentleman from chandigarh and he is 83 years old and he is following us from last 20 years so that is great and uh, you are another example there are very very few investors which i know who are investing from last more than 40 years and you are one of them and you shared your uh, thoughts uh, thank you very much for uh, sharing your thoughts sir uh, very lightning and inspiring Thank you, sir. Thank you, thank you, sir. Thank you very much. Yeah, Amit Solangi ji, you want to ask anything? You have a query? No, sir. Uh, there is no query. Yes. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, yes. You want to say something? नहीं सर नहीं बस बहुत अच्छा लगा सर बहुत दिनों बाद में आपका वेबिनार अटेंड किया तो काफी नॉलेजफुल कंटेंट थी और अभी काफी मतलब इन्फॉर्मेशन भी मिल रही है और धीरे धीरे बुक के पढ़ता हूँ तो वैसे सीखने भी मिल रहा है ओके थैंक यू थैंक यू मिस्टर अतुल एंडली अनम्यूट योर सेल्फ गुड मॉर्निंग सर गुड मॉर्निंग सर uh, मैं सवाल हिंदी में पूछूंगा थोड़ा अच्छे से पूछ पाऊंगा सर uh, मेरा सवाल है कि आप जिस तरह से ये जो डेटा मेंटेन करते हो हाउ डू यू मैनेज टू मेंटेन द डेटा 
how do you get all the information of the companies who are giving the good comments and they are giving the updates of their results and everything there are there's more than 5000 companies uh, listed on the bsc so how do you manage uh, the selective companies it's a simple question for uh, to you uh, as a uh, information should be there for uh, each and every investor thank you uh, as far as the source is concerned there is only one source and that is bscindia.com and there is so much of information there that uh, i am not able to give time to even 80% of that information there is so much of information uh, reading one con call requires at least half an hour and you can very well appreciate that with so many stops we cannot uh, read all the con calls so definitely after after filtering out we read the con calls and as far as the how we select the companies i have given you the examples many examples in the uh, presentation that uh, how i say the spark how to pick the spark how to see the spark and that comes from the statements especially from the statements from the leaders in the industry look for something different what people are not watching what people are concerned is about only the financial performance but financial performance whatever has been delivered by the company is a past what you have to look for is the future because you are looking for the gains in your share price in future so in future company should do well what is that what is that unique thing which you have the access you have not only the access but you truly appreciate it but others are not appreciating it so that is the thing wo kya cheez hai unique sabko pata hai ye sabhi log wahi paper padhte hain wahi pink color ke paper padhte hain wahi magazines padhte hain wahi tv dekhte hain सब लोग सेम चीज करते हैं लेकिन आपको उसमें से कुछ अलग ढूंढना है कुछ अलग उठाना है पिक करना है नॉट फ्रॉम द सेक ऑफ की अलग करने के लिए जैसे मैंने आपको एक एग्जांपल दिया एक बहुत बड़ी कंपनी है उन्होंने एक ऐसा स्टेटमेंट दिया वो मैं कभी मैंने कभी ऐसा सुना नहीं है उस कंपनी के बारे में कि थोड़ा सा ऐसा हट के स्टेटमेंट देते मैंने आपको एक एग्जाम्पल दिया था टाटा एलेक्सी का टाटा मैनेजमेंट से इतना कॉन्फिडेंट स्टेटमेंट मैंने पहली बार सुना उन्होंने कुछ ऐसा नहीं कहा कि हमको कितने ऑर्डर मिले हैं या कितना हमारा टर्नओवर होने वाला है ऐसा कुछ नहीं कहा उन्होंने हमने सिर्फ मैंने सिर्फ ये देखा कि पहली बार मैं टाटा की कंपनी के हिसाब से इतना स्ट्रॉन्ग स्टेटमेंट देखा हूं दैट इज यूनिक दैट इज यूनिक वो आप ढूंढिए मेरे ख्याल से मैंने आपने जो सवाल पूछा था उसका जवाब दिया मैंने आपको थैंक यू मिस्टर उमेश सर गुड मॉर्निंग सर गुड मॉर्निंग गुड मॉर्निंग Uh, sir, as usual, a wonderful uh, lecture, sir. Thank you. Uh, now, my uh, query is in continuation with the other uh, uh, this one. I just want I'm a in uh, some uh, subscriber to your uh, smart ship. Yes, yes, as sir. As well as multi uh, multi bagger, sir. Mm -hmm. Now, only thing is that smart ship. I know very clearly that you are going to give us direction. Whereas in case of uh, multi bagger, you give us and. Uh, the recommendation along with the pro, uh, how much percentage but only thing is that we are not maintaining that percentage like how how do we go about in terms of multi bagger uh, like you understand how much i should invest in multi bagger say suppose tomorrow you give a uh, stock x and how how much should i invest whereas i have already invested quite certain amount in other uh, previous uh, recommendations Uh, I agree with you because uh, in multi bagger it is not a kind of a basket of thing. Correct. It is an open uh, uh, stock advice, and it happens that many times, especially during last one and a half year, what has happened is whatever we advised during last twelve uh, to eighteen months, most of the stocks have already achieved the target. Now, when you achieve the target, you have money in hand, but we are not putting any stock. So you feel that where should I put this money? exactly exactly i know i know and uh, sometimes it may happen that uh, for, for 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 six months hardly one or two stock hits the target and rest of the stocks are still in continuation and exactly comes another recommendation now from where to get the money you don't you are, you are running short of money 
really i appreciate your concern but uh, what you can do is uh, in most of the cases you might have observed that our uh, allocation is from 4% to 6% so you can allocate about 5% to every stock okay. okay so you will have about 20 stocks 20 stocks means uh, a recommendation period of about one and a half years and that would be more than one and a half years and that would be sufficient to have a reasonable money in your hand also still it will not be a perfect uh, basket management portfolio management but you can you can have a reasonably well uh, that thing basket also it may happen that uh, like in case of aggressive we recommended at 129 suppose you are still holding it now it is six times up naturally at that time we recommended 4% weighted but today it's weighted must be about 12% or 13% at least so you can you can sell a part of aggressive so as to bring it down to 6% or 7% and use that money to acquire other stocks. Now, actually, I just follow your instructions, sir. When you say exit, in half an hour, it will be exited, sir. Okay. And when you say recommend, in one hour's time, it will be purchased, sir. So that, that's how I follow. <laughs> the best thing I can tell you is you have, have 4 to 5% weightage in each stock. That is the best thing if you want to maintain a basket of uh, stocks. Sure, sir. So one more, uh, this one I wanted to know is like, how about allocating, say, some 20,000 invariable of, uh, say, the recommended percentage, sir? Suppose uh, each recommendation of multi bagger, mm -hmm. you keep a fixed amount, say, 50,000, 20,000, mm -hmm. or how, how does it work, sir? I'm not right, but I'm just taking your opinion on that. Sir. In which scheme you're saying, sir? Uh, multi bagger. Mm -hmm. uh, say invariable of the percentage that you recommend, sir. Uh, we keep a fixed amount. Say like on uh, FD, I instead of keeping uh, uh, say six percent or five percent, I or just invest fifty percent, fifty thousand rupees on a recommendation. Say Acrisil, and then wait for your advice. Yeah, yeah. So that is also that is also another option. Actually, it is the same thing. When I said that you can make a same allocation, that is five percent in every stock. So. Okay. As good as you are investing the same uh, amount in every stock, okay. and uh, fixed amount is the same thing. See, uh, as I told, as the uh, time progresses, it changing, and uh, it may not remain exactly in proportion. But nevertheless, you will get very good returns. Fair enough, sir. Thank you, sir. Thanks. So, with this, uh, we come to the end of today's presentation i hope we all enjoyed and special th thanks to mr sk patel for sharing uh, his experience and i would like to request others also i am i'm very sure there may be a couple of other investors also who have a good experience and a good experience of at least 20 years they can share their knowledge their uh, experience with the stocks that will be value addition to all of us thank you very much have a good day